going to solve word problems using equations with variables on both sides. And here we have an example of a word problem in which we will use variables on both sides. Blockbuster charges a one-time membership fee of $12 and charges $2 for each movie rented. Redbox does not charge a membership fee, but charges $3 for each movie rented. How many movies must a membership rent for the cost of the two clubs to be equal? Well, first of all, we know we have two clubs here, and we have to find expressions that represents the cost of each of these clubs. So let's go to the beginning of our word problem. We have our first club, Blockbuster, and they charge a membership fee of $12 and also charges $2 for each movie rented. Okay, so here we're going to start off with Blockbuster. And we have to find an expression that represents the cost of Blockbuster's movie rentals. Now, when we find an expression, most times we need to have a constant and a variable. Since we have two numbers here, one number is going to be our constant, which means that that number does not change. It stands alone. And our other number is going to be our variable, which means it will vary depending on um, the number of movies rented. So, if we see here, the membership fee is $12. That is going to be our constant. So, we're going to write $12 plus Blockbuster also charges $2 for each movie rented. Since we don't know the number of movies they'll be renting, that will be our variable term. And we're going to represent the cost of Blockbuster's movie rental as 2M, $2 per movie. Now, since the equation wants to know the cost of the two clubs, what will be the cost of the two clubs to be equal, so we put our equal sign. Now we look at Redbox. And we know that Redbox does not charge a membership fee, but charges $3 for each movie rented. So $3 for each movie rented will be our variable. And we're going to represent that as 3M. Okay? So we need to find how many movies need to be rented from both Blockbuster and Redbox for the cost to be equal. I will draw a line separating both sides of the equal sign. Um, so now we have an equation with variables on both sides. We must move all variables to one side by moving the smaller variable. So here, our variables are 2m and 3m. We need to move positive 2m by doing the inverse operation, which is negative 2m. So we subtract 2m from both sides. Okay? The 2m's here cancel out, so we're left on this left side with 12 is equal to 3m minus 2m just gives us 1m, and we just indicate that with m. Okay? So now to check your answer to see if both sides are equal, we want to do our check here. We want to substitute m for 12. So for Blockbuster, we're going to do 12 plus 2 times 12 is equal to red box, which is 3 times 12. Separating both sides, 2 times 12 is 24, plus 12 is 36, and then 3 times 12 is 36. Yes, both sides are equal, so therefore, um, Blockbuster and Redbox um, must have 12 movies rented for both of the clubs to be the same. 